for another video. Um, today we are going to, um, I'm just going to be showing you, well this is going to be a project I've been wanting to do for a while, I finally got the stuff ready I need ready, and we're going to be making a British army group. So, yeah, and um, my friend, um, he um, was building it with me. And he made it into um, basically an SCPF type base, which is not how I want it. I want it to be a, um, a just a normal, uh, if you know what I mean. Um, I want it to be like a normal modern day military, not a um, SCPF foundation type game. That's not how I want it to do so. Weird. Okay, never mind. We'll do it over. We'll do what we have to do. Over. So over here, I've just been. Basically, what this is is this is going to be military base. I'll, I'll give you a little tour. <laughs> There's not much to tour you about. This is basically gonna be normal kit room. You come in. We have just the basic berets around here. A recruit beret has nothing on it. Um. Uh, other lieutenant colonel plus royal engineers, royal engineers officers, royal artillery. Some legions I haven't come across before. Queen's royal lancers, a special air service. Oh yeah, go on, I'm trying to find the. There isn't a special boat service, which is quite sad, but um, never mind. So I'm just going to move my berries in here. And I don't really, to be honest, do a lot of studio, because I don't see it to be as my thing. I have a friend of mine, um, TSH Cadet, um, and he's been helping me with the guns because I can't build guns because and I can't make them work because I'm crap at life um for this. So yeah, and um that's the gist of that bit, but um I think to, I'm I'm thinking of raising the wall here to about that height, have that up as well. And I'm thinking of actually having glass here. Um, or shouldn't I? Because like, if somebody actually breaks in, they can literally just, you know, sw swivel their camera through here and put on some uniform. This one, I'm meaning to get rid of because I'm meant to put out an one. Because I just want. So the only like um thing that's going to be available in that is um SAS, I think. Um. So um. Because I don't know what this is, but it's um it's not don't know what that is, but it's not part of the training thing. So what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna so I'm gonna um probably move this. I'm not sure if this is training uniform or not. If it is, please tell me in the comments. I don't know a lot of these symbols. So, um, yeah, um, can't really tell you what nationality I am, but it's more of a guess now, isn't it? But, um, I don't know what the hell this is, or this, it's like, terrorist group thing, I guess that is, that's, like, a little black helmet. We did actually have, I had some, like, really cool helmets, but then I don't know where they went. They went somewhere. I can't seem to find them, so screw that. Um. So yeah, let's get rid of this first. We won't be needing that. What I'm gonna have is um. This is gonna be the training uniform. Tell me in comments if this is training or not. I can't decide. Um. 
and um yeah and then if you're like not like attending a training but you um still but um you still want to like go around the base i'm making it so this i'm gonna have hat removers and all around right and um this is what you wear if you're not um going in in training uniform so you'll come you'll come in like this uniform type of thing and um you'll have this helmet on you could if you if you're not in a regiment you will have to buy a gun and um, there will be illegal and legal guns but um but if you are in a regiment say military police for example you'll automatic i think you're i'm gonna make it i'm gonna ask my friend if you can automatically ma um, make it so you receive an sat when um you join or just make an sa80 dispenser if you know what i mean it's like you could just pick it up and again that's dangerous if there are some hackers around who just want a gun without paying for anything so yeah so we're gonna get the full i don't know why i always do this it's just so weird my camera went for a sec there we go i'm using this as my glass because uh yeah I like it. Damn that looking thick. Um me me does that really matter? Answer yes it does because every military base has to be exact or you don't know how to make a base. Um I certainly don't have to know how to make a base. Because this is not my thing, I'm not, I'm more of a gamer than I am a creator, but I thought some YouTubers have made their own games, so I'm thinking of trying, oh, for God's sake, um, so I thought of giving it a go myself, so, um, because other YouTubers have actually been quite successful in making their own games, so, um, you know, I'm gonna give it a go. I'm gonna give it a go. Me and TSH Cadet, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. We're gonna get this done. And yeah, we're allowed. Um, so yeah, um, this is. Um, I'll give you the lowdown on it. Um, I'm gonna be doing a video with a friend of mine. They call me Raya One Two Seven. We're actually school friends because we go to the same school. Um, and um, what we're gonna be doing is. We're going to um um we go we've um handed out our letters in in time to go to this thing called We Day. It's this event you can't physically buy a ticket; you have to earn a ticket, and we did that through charity events with our school. So um, oh, we're hopefully going to record We Day. Um, and um, very sadly, um, one of my friends um, I don't know why on earth because it, um. So my friend checked the letter, and he said he's only going for the McDonald's because we can stop at a McDonald's on the way back. So that's quite sad. Um, so um, yeah, because that's not the point of Wee Day. Point of going to Wee Day isn't stopping at a McDonald's on the way back. It's about getting up at um five five four three o'clock in the morning going there and celebrating that you've done something good that you're helping the future because you're paying you're you're raising you're raising money you're doing events for people who just want to people who like if you know what i mean can't necessarily do stuff so that's the end of it we're going to be live streaming it when youtube on my phone decides to work um yeah had a bit of a problem with it recently so it's being a bit annoying to me and it's not being exactly friendly to me which is sad because i that means i can't record videos for you guys on there so yeah um, as you can see i've made hardly any progress from where we started well done prezel anyways moving on away from we day um I can't stop talking about it because I like to talk, if I'm doing something, I like to talk to people quite a lot. I'm a talkative person, I talk a lot, I'm sociable, 
fifty percent of the time. No, that's more eight no ninety two percent who are being exact here. So um yeah. And I'm I'm sociable and I as soon as I heard of it, um to um I'm not um so I wanted to go I was so as soon as I heard of it, I thought, okay, well we'll see how it is. Maybe me and they call me Ryo one two seven. You have to say that name though. You're trying to say in a video without giving away anyone's real name. Like it's so hard because then you have to use the full YouTube name, and then that doesn't really work out. And then, you know, in the future, I might mistake one of I might say one of my friends' names. I hope I don't. Um. Yeah, I'm probably not going to tell you guys my name unless I've already done that in a video. If so, I'm scared. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> just your average 12 year old boy making a world of YouTube. We um did can, can take into consideration the fact that um we had a briefing with some of the teachers on the we day thing um this morning and they did talk to us about covid 19 you should all know who the, what that is if you don't know i'm ashamed of you it, because seriously i am physically ashamed of you if you don't know what on earth covid 19 is it's i learned something actually that um coronavirus is a group of viruses COVID-19 is the real name for the coronavirus, um, everyone calling, because coronavirus is three viruses, when oh, COVID-19 is the one that broke out in China. I'm smart. If I think, I don't, don't know. People have been advising me not to get models in the models tab thing, you know, the little thing down in the corner there, yeah, that thing. So, um, yeah, and, but I do because I like taking risks. Door. I want a door for this. I want this to work. Security door. <laughs> See, this is all coming up with flipping SCPF stuff. Look, security door. This is something Roblox suggest. Wow, security door. We s totally have that in British bases like Santa's. Oh, God. Well, I'm going to end the video here. I haven't done, like, a lot, but I'm going to carry on. I'll tell you guys what it's like when it's done. Goodbye.